welcome you to the second of our annual conferences, um, uh, Literature and Education. Uh, and this is brought to you today by um, two groups of people. One is the University's Global Lives Research Centre. Um, Brunel University has a number of research centres and the Global Lives Centre is one of those. And uh, thankfully we received some money from them to do some research into the field of literature and education. And one of the outcomes of that is uh, this conference, which was uh, supposed to be held in partnership with uh, ACS International Schools. Um, but unfortunately, obviously owing to uh, the current situation, we were unable to host a face-to-face -face event, but we're delighted that we have been able to run this online event, uh, which we hope will some way get us towards doing something uh, something useful and interesting for everybody um, in terms of developing our thinking about literature and education. So uh, we just wanted to highlight our thanks to ACS Hillingdon for all that they've done and also to the Global Lives Research Centre. Just to talk you quickly through the you're schedule. Not, you're not sharing your screen yet if you intend to be sharing your screen. Am I not? Sorry. Right, let's, let's, let's try this again. We've fallen at the first technical hurdle. Have you have you clicked on the share screen? I have. Person? Right, let's try again. Do we have that? Yes. Excellent. Right, so there's our schedule for today. Um, uh, we, you can see that we're broken down into roughly half hour slots. Uh, we've got a number of excellent contributors with us today. Um, and you can see on this slide and the next one, uh, what we're going to have. Each speaker is begin, given a half hour slot um, in which they will take 20 minutes to, present, uh, to, to give their presentation. And then we'll have 10 minutes at the end for questions. Um, so we've got presentations from David Aldridge, um, first of all, and then from Roger Dalrymple, Bob Eagleston of Royal Holloway and Philippa Campbell. Before we take a break, at 11.05 for coffee. And then we've got a further three presentations from Andrew Byrne and Oli Bilas, and then uh, the poet Daljeet Nagra, who's going to be joining us uh, to end our event uh, just after midday, before we have a chance for some final thoughts in about the last 10 minutes. We're going to invite you as we go along um, to put any questions that you might have for the speakers into the chat box facility. If you put those into the um, chat for for me or David, um, then we can pick up on those questions. Actually, probably just do them to me. Um, and that way I can field the questions and I'll make a selection of questions to put forward to each of the speakers as we go through. You'll appreciate with so many people in the room, we couldn't really have microphones available for everybody. So um, I will put forward the questions on your behalf that you present. We'll also hold a few questions in reserve um, just in case we had any problems and one of our speakers for, for Wi-Fi reasons or anything else disappeared, um, that we can keep things going um, by passing on a few questions to some of the other speakers as and when that's appropriate. So do please enter those up and we'll take those questions to the individual speakers at the end of each contribution as we work through. We're going to keep very strictly to our time schedule um, today so that we can make sure we hear from everybody. And just to let you know that there will be a recording of this event which will make available to you once the event is over so you can listen back at your leisure share with colleagues um, you know if you're having trouble going to sleep tonight um, you can use the the video for whatever purpose you see appropriate just to let you know as well that this uh conference comes off the back of a book series um, which is published by Routledge of which David and I are the uh, the general editors. We've already got one title out in this series, uh, a book on George Orwell and education. Uh, you can see the title there, George Orwell and education, learning commitment and human dependency, uh, which looks at George Orwell's en engagement with education in a variety of different, um, in a variety of different areas. And we're delighted that we've got other contributions already forthcoming in the series. Um, Literature and Understanding by John Fellon. We've got a book on James Joyce and education coming out by Len Platt. Um, and then a couple by contributors that we've got speaking uh, this morning. Um, Andrew Burns got a book coming out, Playing the Text, a book on literature, video games and learning, which I know he's going to talk to us about today. And Oli B. Lass also, a philosophical inquiry into English and creative writing. Um, so you'll get a real flavour of those books, I think, probably as you hear what they have to say today. 
and then a couple of other titles under review, one from a speaker who we've got with us today, Philippa Campbell on campus fiction and education, and then a book on Shakespeare and education, um, which is under review from Jenny Stevens and Pamela Bickley. So we're very excited about the series and we hope that uh, the conference today will give you a sense of the kinds of issues that these uh, books are dealing with, that the series is dealing with. Otherwise, just to say thank you very much for joining us and we hope you'll have a very good morning.